Hey, what's up, guys? It's Limo here. Welcome back to the channel, man. And today marks four years since I've been doing content creation. I was 15 years old, a sophomore in high school when I started this. Now I'm 19 years old doing this while in college as a sophomore. Crazy. I don't know how. And I started off with Instagram and posting content because of my best friend, Jonzo. He got me back into Fortnite and he told me about Instagram and like how you can post your own clips and all that stuff and how there's like a community out there. And so I joined that community and I started posting clips and all that stuff, joined a bunch of teams, met a lot of people. And then I switched over to Twitch full time, basically did streaming for a whole entire year. And then now for the last two to three years, I've been doing YouTube. And while also doing YouTube, I've been doing TikTok as well. But it's just insane to me how much I've done within the last four years. And compared to other streamers and content creators, big or small, right? Maybe it doesn't seem like a lot, but like, dude, I'm happy where I'm at. I'm content with where I'm at to the point where like, you know, I'm still making my own content and it hasn't become, you know, for money. Because a lot of people my age or who I've been doing it for this long have all either, you know, stick with what they've done, quit and or just become money hungry and lost their passion and love for content creating and just have become obsessed with money, right? And I'm lucky that I have not ever like done that at all or become like that. But yeah, man, four years, dude, like it's just insane. I don't know how four years has passed me up like this, but it is what it is. You know, these last three months of making content or the last five months, honestly, since March have been my best months ever out of the four years. One, I've gotten the most views in all my last five months, most subs, most engagement. Um, the community has been the biggest it's ever been, but also the most connected it's ever been. And then lastly, I've finally been getting paid. And I'm like, wow, I did not think as a kid when I was asked by my cousins and family, like, what do you want to do? And I said, I wanted to be a YouTuber and or when I was 15 years old and I was talking to Jonzo about like doing this and it was never about money. It was always about entertaining at least one person, making one person's day better in some way. And I feel like I've done that for the last four years with every single video and getting paid and making money from this is just an add on. It's a bonus that I really don't care about. I'm not really the money type of person where I'm like, I need the money or anything like that. No, like I I've survived on $10 for about two, three months, six months. I survived with a hundred dollars for an entire year. When I quit my job at um, famous footwear, I've done so many things without money and like money's never been a huge thing for me. You know, I know how to survive with it and without it, but also like I'm never been money hungry at all. I would never be like that because I, I hate borrowing money from even my grandma or parents or my siblings. It's always like a shitty feeling with me, but yeah, like getting paid these last four to five months have been insane, dude, because yeah, it's not a lot of money, but like, dude, but like seeing me getting paid, it's like, wow, I'm like, I'm actually doing it. I'm actually being a quote unquote YouTuber, but it's not because I just, you know, uploaded videos and all that stuff. It was because I had the best supporters and the best community, man. I know doing that cliche thing where I'm like, oh, I love my supporters, all that stuff. But like genuinely, I would not be where I'm at with like daily uploading streaming without you guys supporting the streams and the videos and talking to me on my discord talking to me on Twitter, interacting with me on other people's discords like the Ricks. But it's just insane to me that like I'm doing what I said I would do as a kid and four years ago now to this exact day. And I feel like it's just a testament to my commitment to something, at least one thing, man, because, dude, for me, bro, I'm a boring ass person. I don't go outside. I don't fucking, you know, go outside ever. I don't really talk to anybody. I like to keep my circle close. I like to have a private life outside of this and all that stuff. And man, it's just, you know, I'm not, I'm not that interesting of a person unless like we talk about things that I like, right. But I'm always open to learn or do something new if it's with the right people, you know, not with complete strangers and shit, but yeah, man, like I, I just, I don't know how this happened at all, bro. Like four years, there's no way it's been four years, dude. Like, listen, I, I might've gone through, up through some fucked up shit years ago with like mental health and all that stuff. I'll, I'll make, definitely make a video. It's probably be my next video, but like, it does not feel like four years, dude. It's felt like two at most, but man, it's just insane. But I don't want to make this video too long, but four years of creating content. And I'm just so grateful and fortunate enough to have a community and supporters like you guys, because you guys are making my dreams come true and helping me, you know, succeed at this, dude, because not a lot of people do. And I'm just grateful to have you guys here for their journey and 
you know, I'm always forever will be grateful and happy that I get to entertain some of you guys, you know, entertain at least one person. And I'm just, I don't even know other than grateful, man. But yeah, it's been your boy Limbo. I'll see you guys later. And hopefully we get here again next year. Peace.